All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the sky. We've got uh, this guy with us today. Uh, this is Juan. You've probably seen Juan on the channel before if you've been a, a fairly long time subscriber. So Juan has been flying elsewhere. He's getting ready for his check ride. So being a good friend, I said to Juan, why don't we go up? First you pay me money. Going. No, no, just kidding. <laughs> <We're in. laughs> go up and, uh, and, and see how he does, see see how ready he is, see what he needs in order to uh, get ready for his check ride. It so, happens. So, so, so that's what we're doing. So I've got a couple of things planned today. So first thing we're going to do is a diversion procedure, and then we'll do some landings in a little bit. Just just do a little bit, bit of practice. Just two friends flying around. You know, you know doing our thing. Oh, friend! <laughs> But I'm not going 2,500. Why are you not going to go 2,500? Because of the... Are you going to put the beep? <laughs> because of the f***ing <laughs> clouds? <laughs> Alright, cool. Yeah, good choice. Good choice. I like All right. it. Alright. So I stay at 1,500. How far below the clouds do you need to be? Okay, 500 feet. 500 feet? Yeah. So it looks like 500 feet to me, so that's fine. That's cool. Da, 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 da. So we need to head into 272, right? That's correct. Let me correct that. Head. Correct that. So I made Juan do uh, an amazing navigation log which is very neat handwriting and whatever all the way over to brooksville which is over to the west near tampa only two th uh, two things we need are uh, basically initial climb into the first point <laughs> that's all we're doing <laughs> oh wait then a bit so you made me ah oh, come on <laughs> and then we're diverting well then um what juan's also made for the diversion which i want to stress this is not my material okay i got this <laughs> from another youtube channel which shall remain nameless uh... i'm sure it'll come up in the comments below uh, ground speed wheel. So wherever the examiner tells you to divert, if he tells you to divert to the east, you know what your ground speed is going to be. If he tells you to the west, you know what your ground speed is going to be over there. We'll see if it works. <laughs> see if it works, yeah. <laughs> if not, I'm blaming the other YouTube channel. <laughs> Alright, man. Um, looks like there's some <laughs> weather going over Wait. In, uh, in Brooksville's direction. I'm not sure if we're going to make it over there. I'll tell you what, let's uh, let's divert to uh, a popka. A popka? So I'm going to pull my section real quick to you. I notice I'm right between Lake Popcorn. Okay. Close to the edge. So I'm about here. Hold what you're doing right there. Look at this. Let's get high. There you go. Let me get to a, a thousand five hundred and then. Whatever you do, you, you know we got plenty of fuel. So take your time with it. Just look down, do a couple of items, then look up. Look down, do a couple of items, look up. Okay. Always maintaining that altitude. Okay. 1,500, edge of Lake Apopka. I'm gonna measure my distance. So, I know my thumb is pretty much 8 miles. Okay. That's one. And that's two. We're roughly about 10, 10 miles. 10 miles? If I want to be a little bit conservative, I will say 12 miles. Okay. Now, I got my ground speeds here. And I know a heading of zero, zero, 050. Zero, will take me there. I know my ground speed is 126, as I already calculated. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my E6B, which is over here, and then I'm, I'm gonna do my calculus. So I'll start heading. Ex start heading. Start heading over that way, exactly. Okay. That's, that's, really, that's the first thing you wanna that's do. That's the first, start heading. Best guess start heading. Diverting. Exactly. All right. Okay, so I know my distance, 12, and I know my ground speed, 126. So I put my rate on 126, between five minutes and a half and six minutes to get there. Okay. All right. Now we like to plan the fuel we're gonna burn, and I know my rate for this plane is nine gallons per hour. So I put my rate on the nine, and I know it's gonna take me roughly six minutes. No, yep. that part yeah, is right. it almost a gallon. There you go. Point nine gallons. That's S it. Six minutes. Are we going to make it? Yes. Yes, we, we will make it. Perfect. All right. Okay. Sweet. Let's do it. Nice bit of diverting. Now, that's the really old school way of doing things, right? Okay. Luckily for us, we've got a f***ing GPS. <laughs> so. But you understand the, the concept of, of all yes, that, right? Yes, that's nice and simple. The the ground speed wheel helps. Oh, yes, it does. Thanks. To Lizzie. No, I won't. Don't you, don't you I won't. dare. <laughs> there you go. So, yeah. Just, uh, just one point to make, uh, or two points to make. Sure. Diverting your attention between what you're doing and, and, and flying the plane, and then uh, best case head get get to your heading initially, initially, and then, and then do the stuff. Start heading towards the place that you're going. But you did it. You did it all. You got your heading. You got your um, your ground speed. You got the time. You got the fuel. We know yeah, we're gonna make it. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set myself for a landing. 
to get that out of the way. Okay. Orlando Apopka, automated advisory. Wind two two zero at eight knots with gust two one two. Temperature two eight Celsius. Two point two three Celsius. Altimeter two nine nine five. All right, winds are coming from two two zero. The gust in a little bit. So what runway we're going to use? One five one five. Let's do it. Popka Trophy, you got a turkey coming from the southwest, uh, six miles out, inbound, full stop, runway 15, Popka. Nice, you found the airport, look at that. <laughs> okay. I start my procedure here. Very nice, the flaps right there. It just looks so tiny. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Popka Airport, you got a turkey turning base for runway 15, at Popka Airport. With those calls, just add in right base, right base, right okay. downwind. Just, just let people know. I know that we're supposed to be on that side because that's the uh -huh. the way that's set up for the airport. But just so people know, Popka Airport, you get a Cherokee on final for runway Y five at Popka Airport. Bit of a sloppy lineup, uh -huh. but it is. We're correcting, correcting. Ooh. Very unstable. I feel very unstable. Just lift it, lift us up a little bit. Climb us up. There you go. Just a little bit below that glide slope. There you go. Oh. No flare. No brakes, right? Exactly. No brakes. Let it roll out. Yeah, so on this uh, taxiway, <laughs> if you can call it that, just be very careful when we're taxiing down it back to the runway because it's quite close in on both sides. See there's like a, a hill yep. on the right side, so we'll just taxi down that way. On that approach, a little bit unstable as you said. I'm not upset with the uh, crosswind controls or, or anything like that because we landed on the center line. Just be aware of the airspeed. Yeah. I know this is weird because you're looking at the outside. <laughs> Look at the inside because that's what we're that's what you're used to using for knots. Uh, so we came in as you were flaring, which the flare was a little bit higher than than I like. Uh, just bring it down a little bit lower and keep it at 65 because we were at 60 when we were flaring quite high. That's why it kind of dropped cool. on us. So just watch out for that. I just felt a very unstable. Right. And I I felt kind of going fast, but I was. It was very slow. All right, so let's do another uh, soft field take. Off. About traffic, we will. Sport, I never like yeah, this I'll taxiway because look how close that is to that side. No, and then you got this far. Yeah, there you got over exactly. Here. Look how close that is to uh, to the grass. It's really got to be careful. But you know what? There's a center line for a reason, and you're on it. There we go. I remember to add that in. Oh, and there's a f***ing turtle right there. Hold position. I'm oh, sorry, that's a tortoise. Oh. <laughs> Is the turtle guy? <laughs> yeah. Oh, f*** sake. And... Alrighty, got your flaps in there? I got one... Two notches. Four trim. I'm not using no brakes. Roger. Come on. Yeah. There you go. All right, soft field, let's roll. So you feel it want to pop up, kind of relieve some of that pressure, push it forward, there you go. And then now you can just let it come up when it wants to, and then hold it in ground effect. There you go, and then push it forward. There you go. Hold 60. And... Welcome back to the sky. Climbing. There you go. That was nicer. That was nice. That was definitely nice. Stop traffic, light support 731. Take it off, only 15 for right close traffic. Stop it. And I go with my second car. There we go. Popka traffic, you got a Cherokee turning right base for runway 15. Popka traffic. Is this the turn you're talking yeah, about in the just last whole video? Yeah, long turn, yeah. Base the final. Uh, I wouldn't try to kill you, man. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, how's your speed looking? Um, 75, so I'm gonna slow a little bit more. Okay. Alright, so get that power in and get that nose down. And that power is going to help keep you up, but that nose down is going to help you maintain your speed. Okay. Poker traffic, got your okay, final for Roma 15, Poker traffic, touch and go. What's going on, bro? Looking good, speed's looking good.
stop traffic, 731, three quarter mile. Go, five, pressure, back pressure. Five, uh, little bit of instability on that uh, final, and the, the flare is a little bit too high. Okay. That's what's causing us to kind of come down, and it hits, and then immediately goes down with the nose, because we're coming down with a little bit of a slam. But not, not a slam, that, that, that's, that's unfair. Just a little bit harder than, than we need to. All right, we're being... We're going to bring that power back. Five One notch flaps within the range. Uh, we'll the rolls are trimmed I know that it, the wind is trying to push me in, so I'm just going to fight that wind by traffic, pointing into it a little bit. Popka traffic, jerky turning final one five, touch and go, Popka. At this point, what we were doing, what uh, what I saw with what you were doing was kind of pulling the nose up to try and get that altitude back. Just do it with power. You can see how I was back and we're dropping a little bit too much. Just add that power, and the nose is still down, but it stops the descent rate straight away. Right. Start. Oh wow. Oh Jesus. All right, so we're bringing it in. Still got a little bit of power in there. Bringing it in. Bringing it in. Speed's fine. I'm still bringing it lower, lower, lower. I'm starting my flare and power off now. And uh, just kind of holding it, letting it come down. Touch. Holding the back pressure. Okay. Keep that nose up. Pop a wheelie. Flaps out. Let's roll. So just bring it a little bit lower before you're doing that flare. Nice and loose with it as well. Just whenever. You know, it yeah, kind of tries, the, the wind tries to push you off, just, left. you got it, you're under control. Bring that nose down a little bit. There you go. I don't know what the f*** that was. <laughs> the kangaroo. Got a line with their own way. Beautiful. This, yeah. this angle is looking really it's nice. Looking really nice. Speed's a bit high, but you know what? We're penetrating the gusts, so I'm, I'm not upset with that. Right now in five, you can see now that it's dropping. There you go, get that power back in there. You can keep the nose kind of nosed like over a little bit, like but the, the, uh, the power's gonna st stop that descent. And that's beautiful. It'll be better. The approach was better, yeah. just yeah. as we were Touching down the controls, a bit heavy on the controls, yeah. It's nice, easy control inputs. That's what causes a bit of instability on that, it's, uh, just that last few seconds, and then it kind of throws it off a little bit. So just nice, easy on the controls. Okay. If it doesn't want to come down, don't try and push it and slam it down, just hold it off.